Surgeons have been correcting severe scoliosis for decades, but there's only so much they could do. WFMC's Melanie Falcon joins us in the studio with a possible solution in tonight's Health Beat. Well, Wendy and Rob, with typical scoliosis surgery, doctors would straighten the spine but couldn't correct the rotation. So, a telltale rib hump still protruded after surgery. But now, one doctor has a solution. It's family night for Audrey Beeman. She can sit or stand without discomfort after scoliosis surgery to correct a 62% curvature. There was a lot of other stuff going on at that point, but having feeling that immediately immediate release was it was everything it was amazing audrey wanted a straight spine but not the rib hump the bulge that often remains after surgery i could see it in all the pictures i would take and uh you know i i it just felt like i was so different it's not just curved in this direction, but it's also rotated. And that rotation is what causes the rib hump. Dr. Robert Rovner so devised a way to fix the rotation. He puts two screws in each vertebrae, and using extensions like these, straightens each bone into neutral until the whole spine is aligned and derotated. Then he secures it all with rods. Here's how it looks in Audrey. If you're going to go through this operation, you'd like to at least fix the cosmetic part of it as well. And, you know, that's never been ignored, but hasn't been able to be addressed um, as well as we can now. Audrey recently celebrated her spineversary, one year since her procedure. I stand differently, I walk differently, uh, and just seeing the way it looks makes a huge difference. And Dr. Rovner is now working with two companies to improve the hardware for his technique. His hope is that other surgeons will be trained to use this procedure to get better outcomes for patients as well. Robin Wendy. Thanks, Melanie.